guard must think of everything before taking his post. You shouldn't have fallen asleep. You are guilty. You deserted your post. And you don't have a witness. But I'm not a thief, sir. Please have mercy. I'm sorry. Free Ninifer Kepta and take this man to prison. Excellency, I'm not a thief. By the gods, I didn't steal anything. Have mercy. May the gods curse you, Ninifer. May the gods' wrath befall you for lying. Quiet! Why don't you tell the truth? Excellency, I'm not a thief. I can reveal the thief. No, son. You can't. I assure you, I can. Do you not want to find the culprit? Yes. How do you propose to find the thief? I learned from my father. He was good at judging people. Are you sure? I am, Excellency. You can test me now. All right. I know who the thief is. Better you confess, and don't aggravate your crime further. I wasn't even on duty the day the jewelry was stolen. I'm innocent. I didn't steal. I don't have any witnesses, but I saw Ninifer coming out of the jewelry room. I know who is innocent. You can be sure of that. I also know that everybody else will soon know him too. I ask Excellency Hanifer to immediately behead the culprit when I have revealed him. I just want to know who the culprit is. Rodaman is their commander. I will not spare him. Just point him out to me. Excellency Rodaman, they must kneel by this flower bed. Have them blindfolded. Bring the cloth. I give the thief one more chance. If he confesses, he will be forgiven. If he does not confess, he will be beheaded immediately. He is the thief. Draw your sword. That one is the thief. Behead him. No, no, I confess.